Welcome to the Blockchain Report, where we discuss all things blockchain technology, digital assets, DeFi, NFTs, and much more. Today's Layer 3 video, we will be diving into cross-chain with Layer 0. If you don't know from our previous videos, Layer 0 is an omni-chain messaging protocol that can connect uh, different applications on different chains. So it's cross-chain communication protocol, and it's We've been desperately needing something like this for, for years. So it's amazing that we've got this technology built into the ecosystem. And they haven't, they're, they're talks of releasing a token, but it's all murky waters with that. So we don't really know if there will be an airdrop. There might be, but it's good to get interaction on different protocols because layer zero isn't. Like you just go to um, layer zero uh, or uh, it's kind of like, you know, Arbitrum, Optimism, Ethereum. It's just a network, but it's not a specific place you go. Like you don't go to Arbitrum to trade like tokens. You don't go to Arbitrum. They, Arbitrum has protocols on it or the decentralized apps on it. And layer zero has decentralized apps built on top of it, but it essentially is like a, yeah, layer zero um, below Bitcoin, Ethereum, all that. So we will be diving in to magic internet money on layer zero, omni chain money with Radiant, and towards the Stargate with uh, Stargate. So that being said, we'll dive into magic internet money on layer zero. So MIM is one of the first Omni stable powered by oh the Omni stable powered by Layer Zero's OFT standard Omni fungible token. Uh, holders of MIM can now move their stable coins between Ethereum, Arbitrum, BNB Chain, Avalanche, Polygon, Optimism, and more. So swap to MIM will open Paraswap. Then we got some stuff on OP we can swap. Let's log into our MetaMask. Let me swap networks right here. Go ahead and log in. We'll connect our wallet. And you got some USDC. How much do we need? It just uh, it doesn't say. So we'll man magic internet money. We'll just go ahead and do five. Are we gonna, oh, we have to unlock. Um, the heck? Oh, okay. I changed my country real quick. If you're inside the US, you need to have a VPN in order to use this. We'll unlock the USDC. Let's go ahead and do max. Is not. All right. Dismiss. Once this unlocks, there might be two transactions. There might be one. Okay, there's just one. Confirm the trade. Dismiss that, and then we will go and check here. Does it swap it yet? It is swapped. Might take a second for it to. Oh, come on now. Something's up. <clears throat> Something is up. You got, okay. The MIM is there. The MIM is there. Can we get the MIM? I don't think it's working properly. 
I have swapped into my mem. All right, it doesn't look like this is working right now. So we'll have to come back to mem. But next, Omnichain Money with Radiant. Seamlessly borrow and lend across chains with Radiant Capital. In this quest, you'll learn how to seamlessly borrow and lend across chains with Radiant Capital. Radiant Capital provides users with an innovative borrow and bridge function that's via the Stargate stable router interface. Radiant V2 supports deposits on Arbitrum and BNB chain and can be borrowed to any EVM chain supported by Stargate Finance. Deposit any asset on Radiant via Arbitrum or BNB chain. I'm not sure if I, I, I think I've done this. Oh, uh, maybe not on that chain, not on Arbitrum. We'll pop in the Arbitrum mainnet, connect. And I thought I did deposit any asset on Radiant. Hmm. I don't know if I have USDC. Yep. I do. We will deposit some USDC on the Arbitrum network. You can do DAI, you can do USDT, whatever asset you want to deposit. Oh, now deposit. First one's the approval, second is deposit. And I'll just keep my ARB. And is that it? Verify. Nice. So you can share this on Twitter, their layer zero announcement. We don't have to do that. If you want to Ooh, what's the loop APR? Might do this later on when things aren't as crazy. So that quest is complete. Open our chest. We got our assets. See if we get anything here. Nope. I don't know if this is working at all. We'll come back to that. So towards the Stargate, provide liquidity on Stargate Finance to access Omnichain DeFi. In this quest, you'll be exploring liquidity strategies on Stargate and Omnichain Asset Bridge. Understanding Stargate. Stargate users can earn fees by loaning their ERC-20 tokens to the Stargate protocol. You'll be able to stake in a single-sided asset pool with no impermanent loss and collect fees from all incoming transfers regardless of their source chain. That's the magic of Omnichain DeFi. To add liquidity to the Stargate pool on the Optimism Network. I don't think I've done it on the Optimism Network, but I've deposited on other networks. So we will go ahead and connect our wallet. Make sure you're in the on the Optimism side. And we, we, we'll do our $2.90 right there. Oh. Confirm. Actually, I'll go back here.
And OK. So I have the liquidity pool. Hmm. Seems like they're having issues with uh, optimism today. So we'll go ahead and pause this video and come back when it's fixed. All right, it looks like the optimism indexer is working. They were having trouble with layer three yesterday. So we will finish this up. We swapped into MIM. Now beam your MIM. Use Abracadabra money to transfer your MIM from Avalanche, Arbitrum, or Optimism to any chain. We'll get into Abracadabra. And the same with Stargate. We added our liquidity to the pool, and now it seems to be working. Now, Stargate, you stake your Stargate to participate in Stargate governance. You can use Paraswap to acquire Stargate. And I have already done this before. And I don't want to delegate anything because... I don't need to because I can do it on my own, but you can delegate your, that just means that you give your voting rights to somebody else. You don't give your tokens to somebody else, but you give your voting power to somebody else. So you don't have to worry about it, but you got to make sure that you know that that person will have good intention <coughs> with your votes. <coughs> So Stargate is done, bada boom, bada bing. But if you want to go here, you can go to stake and stake your tokens. Make sure I'm connected. So see, I have some locked until 2026. I did that just to get some achievement. So it... It's all right. So I get to vote on governance <clears throat> proposals. And you can go here and if I connect my wallet, this is Snapshot. By the way, Snapshot is where you go to vote on proposals by different communities, different projects and protocols. So this one. You can read their statement and what they're going to do. And you can cast your vote. Yes. And they have a snapshot. So you need to have the tokens before that snapshot. If not, you won't be able to vote on these current ones. So I'll confirm. Sign this. And there you go. I have voted. Pretty neat. And I'm going to vote on this one real quick. So we can rack up our votes. Oh, Uniswap, too. I don't have any Uni tokens. See, if I wanted to vote on this, I don't have any Uni tokens, so I'm not able to. So we'll disconnect our wallet from here. <clears throat> We'll go back to Magic Internet Money Quest where we can beam our MIM from Optimism. Make sure to connect our wallet to Optimism. Bada boom. And we'll go ahead and beam our MIM to Arbitrum. <laughs> oh, what happened? Okay, sometimes it 
will fail. Sometimes it'll go through. You just got to be patient. Let's see. Let's see if it gave it to us. Bada boom. There we go. <clears throat> So we are sending our mem <clears throat> from optimism to arbitrum. And with that, we will disconnect. I will verify and skip. Well, you can just verify. Got 20 XP. <clears throat> and there we go. That is two that we had to finish up. But next, we'll continue through our journey with, uh, where is it? Yeah, the layer zero. We will jump into Bridge Bitcoin with layer zero and introduction to Pendle Finance in the next video. Well, maybe not. Yeah, I don't know. One of these videos, we'll jump into those two. Be on the lookout for more to come. And if you have any questions, comments, leave them down below. But with that, this is the Blockchain Report. Have a wonderful day. Peace.